Hi everyone, Tom here, and today we're going to talk quickly about optimal flow and pressure for your dosatron unit. First, a couple things. You want to make sure that when you have your dosatron installed, that the arrow is pointing the same direction as your water flow. The arrow is located on the lower body, and the unit will not work if the arrow is not facing the correct direction. Next, you want to make sure to open and close your water valves gradually. Opening and closing your valves too quickly can result in a water hammer which can damage the unit or kit components. We never want to exceed the maximum flow rate which can be located on the specification section on the body of the unit. A good estimate is two clicks per second usually means you're overflowing the unit and an adjustment needs to be made. We also offer a chart online which has all of our models of units and their pressure and flow capacities. Additionally, you could install a water flow restrictor and water pressure regulator on the inlet side of your dosatron unit to help protect it. The water flow restrictor help regulates the volume of your incoming water to make sure we do not ever overflow the maximum rate of the unit. Our pressure regulator regulates incoming pressure, especially when there's a potential for spikes that would go beyond the dosatron's capabilities. Of course, with any additional questions or comments, feel free to shoot us a message online or give us a call and thanks for watching.